Radio 702. Talk Radio 702. Comment by John Robbie. One of the things that's interesting in South Africa is the growth of these microbreweries and a list of about uh, 10 of them came through when I spoke about it earlier on. And it seems that there are about 50 of them in South Africa. My biggest customer is a 25 to 35 year old male and female, probably 50-50. Affluent, has a good expendable income and wants something different. Definitely, it's a light, summery sort of beer. Reminds me a bit of uh, Weiss beer, actually. It's got a bit of a Weiss beer taste. Like the other craft beers, it does taste as if it's uh, not from the, the manufacturing floor, so to speak. So it's a great tasting beer and very clean. The average beer is very, they all taste the same, actually. This is a very distinctive taste. This is nice because it's light, you can drink a lot of it. The beauty of craft beer is that it doesn't taste like it's been made in two days, right? It's got that kind of slow, slow drinking, slow taste. I only order craft beer, so this would be definitely one I would order. <laughs> Get on, well played, well played. Oh, <laughs> you bastards! <laughs> Couldn't even taste the difference between craft and SAB product.